To see more RVs and RV related products, be sure to check out socialmedianomads.com. What is going on everybody? Chris here from Chris Travels. NG. So, here we have probably the most expensive and the probably the nicest RV. I don't even know if you can call this an RV. This is definitely a motorhome here at the at the Tampa Super Show. Um, so basically what we're going to do, right now I'm going to talk about some specifications of this particular model and then G and I are going to do a tour. So this is a 2015 Liberty Elegant Lady. Um, this is a Prevost model, the H345 VIP. Um, its total length is 45 feet. This particular model has two slides and of course it does have awnings. Um, the total outside height is 149 inches and the length is 102 inches. On the inside you have 83 inches of space from the floor to the roof. It is powered by a Volvo D13 at 500 horsepower and 1,750 foot-pounds of torque, which is absolutely crazy. Um, it has an Allison uh, transmission, six-speed automatic, and the generator is a 20 kilowatt Kohler, and that is of course a rollout. Um, the solar, there is no solar on this coach and there's no propane. The reason for that is they use master bolt, bolt batteries, which means that each battery costs $7,000. So those batteries are actually meant to last longer than any one of us actually watching this or being here doing this. Like these batteries are gonna last a very long time. This particular coach has $21,000 worth of batteries. So even if you tried to hook solar up to these guys, it wouldn't be enough to power these batteries. In terms of tank capacity, um, this thing actually has a 200 and 30 gallon tank. The gray water capacity is, the gray water and black water is 189, and also the fresh water is 189 gallons. All those tanks, by the way, are stainless steel. Um, the hot water tank is a 20 gallon, and the undercarriage storage total within this coach is 497 cubic feet, which is absolutely crazy. So I am very excited to get started with this tour. And just so you guys know, if you do have that question running in your head right now, how much does this coach cost? This one right now, down to the dollar, is $2,243,000. Okay, everybody, so now I'm gonna show you the entertainment center. So this is our Samsung TV, 60 inch. It's beautiful. And as you can see, it kind of just pulls out on the thing. And I don't really want to mess with it because I'm scared, but it just goes back and forth and it slides right into here. I'm a big fan of white. And then, come over here. So these lights, he was telling us, are LED and they're actually custom. So they're Liberty Coach custom LED lights. And when you turn them on, they actually light up everywhere. And they're awesome. Um, and then these, this is all storage. So we have a fridge out here, just kind of opens up like that so, you know to keep all the beers when you're tailgating and the remote is just kept up here and this controls the lights the TV everything so I don't know if you guys noticed it actually has undercarriage lights and you can actually turn off turn on and off each one of these lights and he's mentioning each one of these costs $500 it's all custom-made stainless steel and they actually own a patent on these lights like they're so bright and so effective um, they actually own a patent. He was saying that basically every time they come out with something, somebody else in the industry copies Liberty Coach, so they had to put a patent on those lights. Um, and then, so all of this right here is just a whole bunch of extra storage, so they kind of just pull out like this. Um, and they all have a really nice finish and a carpeted inside, and they are carbon carbon fiber. They're carbon fiber. So go ahead and pull that out. Each one of these is custom made by the, in, in the factory and this entire piece right here is carbon fiber. So this entire coach is made to last obviously. This entire thing goes all the way through and it actually slides out which I won't show you because I don't want to break anything <laughs> but it slides out so you can actually have storage all the way through there and then up here is the 4K Ultra HD system. So it's just DVD system up here, and then you have some more switches over there. So, 
Also, my favorite part about the outside, even cooler than the 60-inch TV, is this fancy little sink right here that just looks like an outside sink. But then you open this secret portal, and it's an entire water filtration system, which is probably the coolest thing I've ever seen. I'd pay two million just for that. <laughs> Yeah, I bet. <laughs> On the outside. Two million dollars. That is absolutely <laughs> amazing, though. Just the amount of detail that is in this coach, like this water filtration system, is absolutely amazing. And that is right next to the um, outdoor entertainment center, just to the left over here. So then up here, you can control the septic water tank monitor and all that good stuff. So this is a custom paint job. It's beautiful. Give a little zoom out action. You look really close, you can see the sparkles, which I think are the best part. Um, and if you're wondering how much this paint job is, it's actually a $100,000 paint job. No big deal. Um, and the coolest thing about the paint job is that the artist, the um, THOD, actually signs every single um, motorhome that he does. So we actually have a brother, if you will, a sister to this coach right here, and that is a $100,000 paint job as well, all custom made. Yeah. Um, and this is also really neat. So if you come in here where the engine is and everything, they had extra space, and so they made a custom stainless steel box. Um, you can just use water hose, whatever you want in there, and it's not going to rust because it is custom stainless steel. So they actually make this themselves in the warehouse. Um, and then, I don't know how to close that. Um, so we're gonna leave it open. These are the custom stainless steel weavers. Louvers. Louvers, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> the louvers, I was just testing you guys. These are the louvers um, that are also custom stainless steel that they make themselves in the factory. Do you wanna talk about the sparkly letters? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Oh, I need you to zoom in. Okay, so. My favorite part is that each letter, as you can see, has individual sparkles, which I think just really adds to the paint job. This is the, uh, the real rear cap, of course, and um, obviously at the back of it. I think any option we could even think of is going to be on this particular coach. These are the two slide outs with the awnings that go over top. This is your uh, septic dump tank which I need to it add. It even a, looks pretty. <laughs> I need to add a couple zeros to my paycheck, maybe four or five zeros to my paycheck before I need to learn about a system like this, but uh, that is pretty immaculate. Second slide out. And as you can see, all of these custom LED lights are all around. And circling around to the front of the coach. Absolutely. Immaculate. All right, everybody. Chris here from Chris Travels. Today we have a very exciting video for you. We have Frank here. He is the owner and operator of the Liberty Coach. These are probably the most luxurious and highest quality coaches we've seen in the entire show. Um, Frank, thanks for having me today. You're welcome. You're welcome. A little bit about Liberty Coach. Uh, we've been building coaches since my parents started doing it in 1968. So basically we're getting into 46 years here of doing custom bus interiors, bus conversions. Uh, my brother Kurt and I are the ones that run the company. He does all of our production handling in North Chicago, Illinois, and he does all of our cabinet design floor pan layout. His wife, Kim, does all of our interior decorating. I do the engineering as far as the electrical, mechanical, all the remote control systems, and handle our sales and service uh, operation in Stewart, Florida. Uh, what we're in here today is a 2015 model of what we call our Verona, which is a two-slide model that has over-the-road bus air, which means that as you're driving down the road, this coach will keep you cool without running the generator, without running on battery power, because it has a 10-ton compressor running off the main engine. Uh, some of the other features that we have in this coach, 
being that it's two slides, you're able to use every part of this coach with both slides in. So there's nothing that you can't get to. You can get around the bed. So you never really have to put the slides out when you get to some place just for like overnight uh, as opposed to triples and quads where you have to do all that. So it has a unique aspect in that part of it. We have uh, appliances that we use in the Liberty Coach are going to be top of the line. We have a Mealy oven, convection oven that's also a microwave here. Keurig coffee maker which is plumbed in. We do a Gagano cooktop system. Uh, we do also Sub-Zero refrigeration, so we have the Sub-Zero refrigerator with freezer drawers and the ice maker built below. Uh, audio video wise, what we have in this coach is top of the line. We have a company that I partnered up with by the name of KEF, K-E-F, which is the oldest speaker manufacturer in the world. We custom designed speakers for this coach in the living room, bedroom, and down in the entertainment center. They're hidden, you can't see them. We do a very good job of, of uh, handling that part of it and we have a surround sound processor here and once it's all lit up, it'll blow your mind. Um, we have gone all to 4K UHD uh, TV units from Samsung. Uh, we have a 55 inch that we put up in the front. We have a 65 inch that we put down in the bay and we have a 32 inch that's in the back. 32 is not UHD. Um, all of the cabinetry that you see in here is all done composite other than the moldings that you see in the ceiling and through the cabinetry. The moldings are all going to be solid wood, but the rest of the cabinetry is going to be real veneer uh, on a foam core base material substrate, which means that we have the lightest interior in the industry. We are well underneath the weight characteristics on the Prevo shell, something that not, nobody else in the industry can state based upon all of the things that we have in the coach. Um, we have an exclusive uh, trademark called the Liberty iLink, which uh, is how we iPad interface and iPhone interface, interface or Android, something, whatever you want to do with that into the coach, both while you're in the coach as far also remotely. So this all uh, is done through a system that we wrote the programming for and tie into the complete electrical architecture in the coach. So our remote control system just, not, just does not do audio video. It also controls every mechanical and electrical aspect that this coach has, other than starting the engine. As we go through the layout that we have been known for for a long time, you have the ability to get into the bathroom area two different ways. So if you have the hallway shut down, it does not shut down the ability to get into the bathroom, either from the front or the back. The bedroom suite arrangement that we have here, our mattresses are custom made for us. They're a unique uh, foam based material that, uh, in fact, most people that have this will end up putting them in their homes. But we uh, try and do everything we can, as you can see the cabinetry being radiused all the way it flows to give you the most amount of room and to give you the largest spatial feel that you can have in a 45 foot coach that's eight and a half feet wide and of course almost 11 or 10 and a half when the slides are out. The flooring of the coach is all done in the, what's called Amtico. It's, uh, we have a clear plastic on it now to protect it. Uh, it is a sandwiched floor, it is very light material to use, and it also is heated, so there's four zones of heating in the floor as well. I think that pretty well covers it. All right, thank you, sir. Thank you very much for your time. You're welcome. Hey, everybody, Chris here. And G. I'd like to thank everybody for watching. Please hit that like button if you could, and if you had done so already, please hit that subscribe button. And be sure to check out our latest videos from the Tampa RV Super Show, and also all of our videos about moving into our new Class A. Hope everybody's doing well out there. Catch you later.